According to reports, North Korean leader Kim Jong-un ordered the execution of up to 30 officials allegedly due to their failure to prevent deaths caused by devastating flooding and landslides. The disasters reportedly resulted in approximately 1,000 deaths. This kind of punishment is unimaginable in India, but this and more can happen in North Korea because dictator Kim Jong-un is its supreme leader. According to a report by South Korean's Cho Soon TV, citing a North Korean official, Kim Jong-un called for strict punishment to be meted out to those deemed responsible for the unacceptable loss of life caused by the recent flooding. Officials were also charged with corruption and dereliction of duty. The executions reportedly took place late last month. It has been confirmed that 20 to 30 cadres in the flood-stricken area were executed at the same time late last month, the official was quoted as saying. Although the identities of the executed officials remain undisclosed, the North Korean Central News Agency reported that Kang Bong Hoon, the secretary of the Chang'an Province Provincial Party Committee since 2019, was among the leaders removed from their positions by Kim Jong-un. In July, severe rainfall triggered landslides and flooding in North Korea, affecting over 4,000 homes and leaving 15,000 residents displaced. Kim Jong-un himself visited the affected areas and stated that it would take several months to rebuild and restore the neighborhoods that were completely inundated by the floods. The government also provided shelter in Pyongyang facilities for 15,400 people, including vulnerable groups such as mothers, children, the elderly and disabled soldiers. However, the North Korean leader denied reports of a high death toll from the flooding, dismissing the claims as false rumors. He accused South Korea of spreading these rumors as part of a deliberate smear campaign being propagated to damage North Korea's international reputation. According to Korea Times, North Korea's public executions have surged dramatically since the COVID-19 pandemic. Before the pandemic, the country typically saw around 10 public executions per year. However, that number has shot up to approximately 100 annual public executions, representing a tenfold increase. News Desk, Global.